Hey guys, it's Poppy, and today I'm going to be kind of giving you guys a review of week one of the revision course that I'm taking. So I'm currently enrolled in the How to Revise Your Novel class that's taught by author Holly Lyle. If you're interested in finding out more info about the class, you can click on the link that will be down in the description box below. Okay, let's talk about week number one. So once you sign up for the course and you pay for it, you get access to your own kind of How to Revise Your Novel like lesson page. So the way the lessons are kind of broke down so far, um, this lesson, there were three parts of it. So the first PDF you get is the actual lesson, and you read through it. It was probably like over 20 pages long, and it kind of explains to you what you'll be doing that week. Part, part number two is all about the worksheets that you'll be using that week. And then part three, which I thought was a really cool little feature, is a demo of Holly Lyle actually going through and revising a novel along with you throughout the course. And so in part three of this week, she kind of is showing you how she filled out the worksheets for this novel that she's revising. And it was really cool, like if you had questions, most of the time they were answered by the demo. The other thing I'll mention is that you also get access to the kind of online forums on her website. And those forums are really only for people who are signed up for one of her classes. So if you had questions or or kind of comments you wanted to make about the lesson plan, you could make those and there, there are other people there that are taking the course with you, some who are ahead of you, some behind you. Um, but yeah, I thought that was a really cool little feature. So there were a couple of points that she made in lesson one that were just so kind of good for me and like just gave me lots of hope about this process. One is that the first time is the hardest. Like the first time you revise a book, it's gonna be the toughest. This is where you're kind of in the trenches and you're learning the technique, but that it's gonna get better from here. Here. So that was kind of encouraging to know. And the other thing that she mentions is that nothing is unfixable. And I just loved that, you know, the thought of that, that no matter how bad you think your first draft is, it can always be fixed. So a big part of week one is reading through your first draft. But you're not just reading it like for fun. Although that would be fun to finally read it. And it was awesome to finally get to go back and read what I'd written. But it's also about doing it in conjunction with these worksheets that you have. And each worksheet is kind of like a specific thing that you're looking for as you read through your book. So it's a really kind of detailed look at you know, kind of ripping your book apart to some degree. And something tells me that this is only kind of the first phase of that. Um, just to get, kind of give you guys kind of a quick peek, I will show you a tad bit of my worksheets from week one. Um, front and back, you guys. Um, so this, this was just seriously intense. Um, yeah, the 1B worksheets are like no joking around, and I had to print off so many copies of them just because I kept filling them up, and so yeah, they were, they were intense, but it's amazing, I will say, now that I'm done, to know that I have this really kind of detailed look at my first draft, so I'm really excited about that. I think, too, another kind of theme of this lesson is kind of remembering what you originally wanted your book to be, like when you initially got the idea, and then kind of taking that and comparing that to what you ended up with in your first draft and figuring out what you need to fix in your revisions. And it was a lot of work, you guys. It took me a couple of weeks to get through my first draft, but I'm so excited at this point to be done with that portion of the class and to know that I have this detailed look at my draft. One just fantastic thing about lesson one was getting to finally read through my first draft and something amazing happened, you guys. I realized that yes, there were things that were wrong, but there was so much of my book that I actually really enjoyed. And there were times where I was reading not just because I was you know doing my worksheets but because I wanted to keep reading because I wanted to know what was coming next you know it's like that feeling of anticipation I even had that even though technically I already know what's gonna happen so you know it's kind of I'm not the reader I'm the writer but at the same time I still had that feeling and that was really good and then there were other instances as well where like scenes that are very emotional that were emotional for me to write you know like I found myself crying towards the end of my book and, you know, the fact that it elicited that kind of emotion from me, I feel like is a really good sign. So I was excited about that, excited to finally kind of look at it as a whole and realize that, yes, there are some major things that need to be fixed, but that there are some really good things there as well. So that was good to see. So that's my week one kind of review of this course. I will be keeping you guys up to date as I go week by week. And, um, yeah, I've got a few lessons that I'm behind right now because, obviously, it took me a couple of weeks to do week one. But that's normal from what I hear. And sometimes it takes people longer than it took me. So that's okay, though, you know. We're going to finish eventually. Okay, guys, that is it. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys soon. Bye.